This is the step-by-step -step tutorial of the TP Zoo's favorite stay-home art kits, the Paper Mache Friendly Ghost. In this kit, you will receive all the supplies needed in order to make your ghost. Begin by inflating your balloon and taping it to a secure surface like a bucket, a cup, or a bowl. This will help not only catch the excess glue but also make it easy for you to layer it on top. Taking the sponge brush and the glue, layer on a layer of glue onto your balloon. Make sure you don't go all the way to the edge of the balloon, but cover the entire top surface of it. Take some of your white tissue paper and press it down onto the top of the balloon. Then add another layer of glue on top of that tissue paper and then add a new sheet of tissue paper on top of that. You're going to repeat this at least five times. We recommend layering it unevenly so that one side is longer than the other so when you're finished with all of your layers, your ghost will have some length to it versus placing the tissue paper directly in the middle of the balloon. Once you have finished layering the tissue paper, take your string, tie the edges into a knot, and then take a small piece of tissue paper and glue down the string to the top of your paper mache. Adding multiple layers of tissue paper and glue will ensure that it sticks on very tightly. Now it is time to add some facial features to your ghost. Take the black construction paper and cut out eyes and a mouth and glue them onto the face of your ghost. Allow this to dry for at least 24 hours, the longer you wait the better. Once it is hard, you can then go inside and remove the balloon from the ghost's head. If you've waited a long time, the balloon might have even deflated from the inside. But go ahead and remove any of the balloon remnants from your ghost. Once you have taken out your balloon excess, your ghost is now ready to hang and enjoy for a friendly and fun Halloween decoration. Be sure to take videos of your creation and send them over to be featured on our Instagram. Don't forget to follow us for more creative art ideas.